Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, today is a really exciting day because we're going to be receiving a box with, spoiler alert, live animals. Yes, animals. Multiple. So it's really exciting. I'm actually waiting for the box right now. Um, it's coming through FedEx. So when I see a FedEx truck coming down our driveway, you know I'm there and I'm running. I'm running for the package. But yeah, it's going to be exciting and when it comes, you're going to be opening it with me and, you know, setting them up and yeah, see you guys later. So guys, the animal just came in. I just ran downstairs to go get it. So this is the box and I got to grab a opener. Okay. So I got the box cutter. I'm just going to open it right now. And these reptiles are from Evergreen Reptiles. It's a uh, Evergreen State Reptiles. It's a local reptile breeding company in Washington, and they have great quality animals. So I'm gonna try to open this as gently as possible. I'm not very good at <laughs> opening boxes, obviously. I want to get them out as. did throw in some cool merchandise there's a uh, pins if you guys can see that awesome um, I got one of these pins some stickers ooh this is really cool Daniel stop sorry my dog's running everywhere <laughs> but yeah uh, now we're gonna get to the actual animals. Ooh, styrofoam. Some of these. This is a heat pack, yeah. So there is a heat pack in, so the animals should be warm. I do live in Washington, so the nights are not that warm yet. But here they are. So I'm going to put them in frame. Put the box down. And oh my gosh. They're here. So obviously you can see they are leopard tortoises. So I'm going to just take each one of them out to make sure they're okay. Hi. Oh my gosh. Look at this one. Oh my god, the lighting's so bad. But here's this one. That's one. I'm gonna put them back because I am gonna soak them after. Oh, here's the next one. These are so hard to open. Here's this one. I know they might all look the same to you guys, but there's a clear difference when you look at them. Next one, this one I think is my favorite just by looking at it. Whoa, wow. It's like so dark and chocolatey. Oh, he's saying hi. And then the last one is this one. This one is a little scared. I'm pretty, he is good, but he's a little shy. He, here he is. That's the last one. Maybe if I do it this way. Uh, all right, I'm so stoked. Um, as you can see, they are all well. They're pretty warm. They're not cold at all. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing part. Next, I'm just going to go ahead and soak them and then show you guys. Okay, so I got them out of their deli cup containers and now they are all soaking. Oh my 
go. Um, three of them are actually quite active. They're moving around, but this one, not so much. But he is, he's in there. He's just not, like, coming out yet. So I will update you when I do the next thing I have to do for them. All right. <laughs> Look how cute. So, guys, the tortoises are in their tortoise table now. It's just this one. It's the Ituven. I think we got it from Amazon. If I'll probably link it below if you guys care. But yeah, so this is their tortoise table. I don't know the exact measurements off the top of my head. So 36 by 24. Okay, yeah. So 36 by 24. All right, I'm going to try to get this up. Is there <laughs> one in here? Can you, can you hold this? That's, that's gentle. Uh, no? No, oh, the one's right there. Huh. But yeah, so this is their setup. This is their food bowl, which I have food. I offered it to them and I think they ate it because it definitely looks like they ate it. But I don't know for sure. It might have just shriveled up. Uh, their water bowl, they can get in and out of it. I've watched them do it already. Um, their bedding is reptobark, but in this hide, there's some spag moss and in the back part, actually have spag moss too. So cool. And mulch. Yeah, so it's like cool, humid, and then hot, humid just to give them variety and then here they are that's one of them i believe that is scratch this one is gonna is spellman no scratch is in this back corner who's that that's night whoops well that's night that one's scratch that's spellman and that's blackwood if you guys didn't already catch on to the theme, it's from Sabrina Spellman, Chilling Adventures. But yeah. So, the Chilling Adventures of yeah, Sabrina Spellman. The, yeah. If you're a comic book reader, you know Archie Comics. So, But yeah, so that's their setup right now. And we just, we're going to let them acclimate, obviously. And for the lighting, right now we're testing out this thing. It's a nano like yeah, a zoom nano, nano a zoom ed nano which it's gonna have a bathing bulb and it has a heat emitter but both of them are not gonna be on the heat emitter is only gonna be at night we're actually trying to see if the bathing spot gets to 85 i mean 95 because the other bulb we were using was for our other tortoise also kata and it got really hot so i turned it off immediately once it got too hot and we're gonna try this one out it's a 40 watt bulb yeah, instead of watt yeah nano. instead of a 50 and what is the Heat 40 watt as well. Okay. Everything's 40 watt for the nano. All right, and we're gonna try to get that at a 95 bathroom spot for them. It's at about 91 right now, 90. Okay, but yeah, we'll update you if anything else goes on. But if not, enjoy B roll. Yeah. Alright guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. The tortoises are in their tortoise table getting settled in now. It may take a few days to a week for them to get settled in. So I'm not too worried about them like not eating as much, not moving around as much because, you know, it's a new environment for them. So yeah, if you got thrown in a new environment, you wouldn't like jump straight into it. So yeah. I will be doing an update video probably a few weeks from now. Don't know how long it'll take them to get used to their environment. But yeah, uh, thank you so much for watching, guys. See you later.